we pre-write and we've got lots of time, spend lots of time on your pre-write. Spend half an hour researching your information and filling in a T-chart or filling in a storyboard. Spend lots of time. But they also need to hear if you're taking a test or if you have a short amount of time, your pre-write needs to be done in 12 minutes. And then you're moving on. They need to be able to get it done in that amount of time and they need to know, don't spend half an hour on your pre-write when you've only got 55 minutes for the whole thing. So we teach them to massage it and work it. Drafting. If you've got tons of time, then spend more time on that first draft. If you don't have tons of time, then make sure that that first draft is done the absolute best you can, but keep your eye on the clock and make sure you don't run out of time so that you don't have an ending, right? That you, you had to just stop because the time was up. Revising, if you've got tons of time, it's like story surgery. I can cut that thing apart and glue it back together. I can do more research and add it in. But if I've only got a little bit of time, revision and editing turned into check and change, right? Quick check, looking for major mistakes, looking for obvious mistakes, change them and move on. Nobody's cutting the paper apart and taping it back together.